Hello? Yeah, I'm a big scammer, yeah. We are okay, everybody! We are okay! I'm so paranoid, it's so bad. I can sell you a bag of dog shit, dude. Oh. Oh, you think I'm going to jail? Why? Why would I? I am a convicted felon, guys, I will be honest with you. I got in big trouble when I was 19. First time I ever got in trouble, too. I've definitely learned my lesson. This is it, guys. It's over. It's so over. But we're okay. Who's not okay right now is Austin. Those damn rat cops got him again. Now, if you've been following his story, this comes at no surprise. Has he had a standing warrant for his arrest? For violating the conditions of his bond? For being kicked out of rehab that he was supposed to have completed? That should have lasted 30 days? But worse yet, we just learned today, this is breaking news. Bossman Jack has caught more charges. So as you guys can see on the screen right now, I'm in the Virginia Judiciary website and this is where I looked up the charges against Austin. There's new things here. Don't just have the bond condition violations. Now, first time I saw this, the, the first thing that caught my eye was the obstruction resisting without force and the elude disregard police misdemeanor. Meaning Austin was trying to run away from the cops and when he got caught, apparently he resisted or obstructed without force i would love to have the body cam footage of this arrest as well as the other ones now an interesting detail with these two charges before i get to the other one when you check the information on these charges these didn't happen in troy virginia where austin lives these happen in gordonsville that's around 20 something minutes from from troy virginia so he knew the cops were coming and he ran away before they they showed up or he went to meet somebody at gordonsville maybe mr christmas i don't know but the cops caught him there so going back to the third one the assault and battery of a family member now we've seen this before we can see it down there a fan states second of july but this is a new one you know what this means you know what this means rats this means the leaked call I gave you guys was real. TJ Trapp's call with Rat Dad was real. The dates match. Holy shitballs. In that call, link to it down below by the way, Rat Dad said Austin slapped him around again. And this confirms it. This happened in the day that Bossman just, you know, left without a trace and allegedly went into the hospital. I've been in the hospital, bro. Or as Rad Dad sent in the call into a penal facility. Not, not jail, actually a, a penal facility. Ah, <laughs> penal. And with regards to this charge, he had his hearing about it today, actually, this morning. It's apparently been continued by agreement. I'm not sure what that means. I'm not a law guy, but he will have a second hearing about this on the 21st of February next year. So yeah, guys, this, this is looking pretty bad. We rats in the in the rat discourse had been speculating that he probably might get away with the previous charges he had, give him a slap on the wrist or whatever. But now with these extra charges, things are looking grim. I would love to have your guys' input on this. Maybe some of you are into law or have had run-ins with the law yourselves and can tell me about this stuff. To me, uh, an educated observer, this looks pretty bad. Austin's gonna have the uh, bond condition violation hearing tomorrow. So I guess we'll have more news tomorrow as to what is going on with this case. And I'll try to get, keep you guys updated on it, either on video or on Twitter or on the Discord. So those are the news regarding Austin's uh, recurring jail situation. Now, on a previous video, I told you guys how Austin scammed G-Bear for some Counter-Strike skins that he then later sold on the market so basically he got he got himself double paid for those skins i had neglected to show you guys what triggered this response from austin what's up with your with your profile picture bro why the f would i trade you a goddamn thing no no absolutely not no i'm not showing to the screen it might get me banned so here is the steam profile of g bear and i'll have you notice what his profile picture is that's what set boss man off if you'll notice that's a um a, a lovely lady but in front of her there are window bars so what happened there was in austin's crack paranoid brain this was immediately a diss against him he he was felted by this because to him this is this is a jail joke this is g bear subliminally making fun of Austin. Hey, you're gonna go to jail. Haha, <laughs> here's a picture of a woman behind some jail bars. That's how crazy this guy is. 
Now, I was also informed from, um, let's say, private sources that Bossman also tried to scam someone else for some Counter-Strike skins. And at first, he almost got away with it until Mr. OneTap pulled some strings because he had a friend of his that was close to Austin that pressed Austin into actually giving OneTap the skins that he was owed. So if G-Bear getting scammed didn't drive home to you the fact that, that Bossman Jack is a scammer and a liar, I hope that this will. He he tried to do it to someone else that bought skins from him. He just couldn't get away with it because somebody in close proximity to him, IRL, pressed him into not scamming the other person. And if that's not enough, how about the fact that this is the second time that he's assaulted his father? Okay. Are we okay? I'm okay. I hope you guys are okay. Now I can't just leave you guys with a video of just me yapping. So here's some funny clips from before he got arrested again and some of them even from before he disappeared for about five days so i'll let you guys enjoy that and i'll see you guys in a bit listen to this song listen to it you fucking pussies listen to it pussy oh shit what am i doing oh my god am i live dude that is CBD, I promise guys. It is CBD, it's actually has no THC in it. Where's the door? Door's uh, the door is, hold on, where is the door? Is that a door you see? It's attached, oh my God. Can't do that one no more, boss. Can't use that one. I got a door that fucking works. Get on my level, dude. Yeah, I'm a big scammer, yeah. Big scammer, yep. Yeah. I'm here to scam you guys, yeah. Yep, how'd you know? Damn, dude. That's up, dude. Let's go, dude. Guys, I gotta get this tooth fixed, don't I? That's pretty bad looking, but it doesn't bother me. It doesn't bother you guys, hopefully not. I don't want to go to the dentist. I know I'm gonna have hella cavities and, like, teeth problem. But I should go, shouldn't I? This is the same room, dude. Check me out. Same room, boss. See the hole in the wall? It's at a different angle. And it's flipped horizontally. Okay, I'm feeling okay too. I'm feeling okay, dude. I'ma clutch this shit up for me and my fucking dudes. We are come through. That's some fucking bullshit, dude. This is. So That's weird. How do you know I was there, guys? How do you know, guys? How the fuck did he know? How the fuck did he know? I wonder. Fucking pussy. Look at this hacker. Fucking hacker. Oh my god, I'm that high, dude. My brain is damaged, guys. It is. I'm sorry for that. Thanks for stopping by Bossman's Records and Stores, and uh, hope you come again. I got the sales riz. I can sell you a bag of dog shit, dude. That after me and Shuffle parted ways, they juiced me up thousands of dollars. I'm in. Oh, no, it was the wrong password. Why did have me do a, secu a security check? It's not easy, bro. It's not easy, bro. You know, it's, I was doing that shit every day, all day. Every day. Every day. Every fucking day. Every fucking day. So it was not what I wanted to do anymore, you know? I'll show whatever I want to show on stream. And uh, sure, I can, yeah, sure. No problem, dude. The other one's a little dirty on the bottom. It still doesn't mean nothing. But why would I show my, my hands? I don't know. I shouldn't have to defend myself from nothing. Because I've done nothing. You just live sad lives trying to do anything and everything to just find something that makes me look bad. Just think about that. You will do anything and everything, find anything to make me look bad. And I'm not. It's not, the, it's not the truth. Oh, I lost it all. No, no, you f***ing dickheads. <laughs> there you go, guys. I hope you enjoyed the clips. I got to shout out my, my friend again, Lolstar, because these clips came from his videos. Uh, go check him out. Go give him a sub. He needs the support right now because he's been getting community guideline strikes for bullshit just because he was showing boss man gambling. Somehow he was promoting gambling. <laughs> There's nothing worse to promote gambling than to show boss man gambling, but okay, YouTube, okay. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the, the video. I hope you guys enjoyed hearing the news about Austin, going to jail again, and I'll always be keeping you guys updated on uh, what's going on with Austin. But while we're deprived of uh, any new content, I will be revisiting old content that I haven't covered yet. But I will also be introducing new characters to the channel, including another big gambler. He's uh, another gambling addict. I think you guys will enjoy it. All right, that's enough yapping for me. This has been Pickle Time. See ya.